Hey there. So I tried doing a Facebook live the other day about how I incorporate this It Works business into my life. And um, it didn't turn out very well because my internet was, um, connection was wasn't very stable. It was weak. And so I thought, you know what, let me go ahead and just show it to you on here. So I'm going to redo this. And for me, incorporating It Works into my life also involves incorporating things um, for myself. I think the biggest change that I've gone through with this It Works business is just personal, personal development, figuring out who I am, taking care of me. And yeah, it's pretty neat and it's about time. <laughs> so let me show you how it is that I incorporate this It Works um, into my life and how you can incorporate in too, because right now we're all super, super, super busy. We're just, we're super busy. So I just put busy, me too, but the busiest people are the best people to have in your business. The reason we're the best people to have in your business is because we know how to time manage. We know how to make things fit. I mean, we can juggle all kinds of times and, and things. <clears throat> we squeeze everything in. So busy people is what you want. So when somebody tells you they're busy, you're like, good. People who are not busy tend to be a little bit lazier and, um, and we don't want that. We want some go-getters. So here's pretty much what I do. All right. So here's some things that I suggest though, before we get started with that is there's some must haves because they go along with some things that I have on my list to do. So must haves are some Bluetooth headphones. They're awesome. Sometimes when you're um, going for a walk, <clears throat> a lot of the, my motivation for going for a walk and for a run is because that's when I get to listen to videos and get to listen to the family calls and the, um, you know, show me the money calls and stuff like that. So get you some Bluetooth headphones. I also suggest getting you a portable mobile charger because I don't know about you, but my phone has never died as much as it does right now. It's crazy. I do suggest getting a composition notebook too. And we're, um, anytime you hear us talk about the 100s list, me personally, I have my in the composition notebook. And so I scratch out, I cross off, I do all kinds of stuff. I do do some things on Excel or Google spreadsheets. And so I have some other ways of keeping up with it as far as follow up, but knowing, having my list, I have it in the composition notebook. All right. And then a daily planner. Uh, I personally have one that is a 24 hour planner because I need to see my whole day. So get you some sort of planner that works for you so that you can figure out your time and how you can squeeze in what it is that you need to squeeze into your day. Okay. All right. So <clears throat> here's an example. Let me move me here. Here's an example of my busiest um, day of the week. And this week it's going to be this Thursday. So first what you want to do is you want to fill out your day's daily schedule and it does not include it works. Okay. So mine's between six and nine. Here's the way mine pretty much goes. So at six o'clock I'm, we're all up getting dressed and ready to head to work and we have to leave at seven. If we don't leave at seven, everybody's going to be late. Okay. So I'm at work by eight 30, start teaching. I start teaching at nine, but eight 30 to nine, I get my stuff ready and you know, uh, copied and all of that stuff being a teacher. Well, this Thursday I have two tans. I have one at one o'clock and I have one at two o'clock. And so then three o'clock is what I consider family time because at three o'clock is what time I start. Uh, I have to go pick up my kiddos. <clears throat> and then from there we have to start um, our homework. Okay. Once we get home, which isn't very far, we have to start our homework. And at some point in there, I'm going to cook dinner and then we have to eat because what's going to end up happening is um, my kids have practice on Thursdays, basketball practice on Thursdays. So I've got to drive them to practice. And then by the time you drive home, by the time we get home at eight o'clock, everybody's getting dressed and ready for bed, getting everything ready for tomorrow, making lunches, probably eating again because my kiddos eat all day, They're constantly hungry. So all of that's happening between that eight and nine o'clock showers, everything. And so by the time I read them a book and put them to bed, it's nine o'clock and that's my whole day. Okay. So when I say family time, it includes all of that picking up kiddos, doing homework, cooking, eating dinner, taking boys packs. I mean, all kinds of stuff. Okay. All right. So now what I'm trying to do is figure out in this day right here, there was absolutely nothing about me, no me time. And there's nothing about your works. So I got to figure out where to put it. And so I've got a success list. So what I know that I want to do with um, my day is I want to do something with personal development. I got to do something for me. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to wake up and I'm going to pray. 
okay? It takes about one to two minutes, not very long, but I'm gonna pray over just everything, my business, my family, my, I mean, you name it, I'm praying over everything, okay? <clears throat> I wanna get some exercise in for myself because it makes me feel really good. I wanna view some videos for both personal as well as the business, and I've got some books that I'm reading for both personal and for business, and then I've got on here for it works. I definitely wanna listen to the calls on the certain days, like the family call, the show me the money call, um, there's one more, I can't think of the name of it, okay? The other thing I'm gonna do for business is I'm gonna grow my network. So I'm gonna add 100 people to Facebook, which takes a few minutes. I'm gonna add 10 people to Instagram. I'm still learning how to do that, but Instagram is something I'm gonna be concentrating on pretty soon. And then I wanna develop a relationship by commenting and liking those potentials, because when I add, when those people accept my friendship, I add them to a potentials list, but we'll go over that later. All right, another thing I wanna do is I wanna post on social media. So there'll be two personal posts, not anything to do with It Works. There will be team, two team posts because I will be pouring into my team. And then I'm gonna do four posts regarding It Works. One will be a product, one will be a business, one will be a before and after, and one will be a lifestyle. Like how has this helped? It Works helped my life. Like thanks to It Works, I was able to put gas in my car, buy groceries or whatever the situation, okay? And the last thing I wanna get done for the day is I wanna message folks. So I wanna message 10 total people from my 100s list. Five of them are gonna be about the business or being a customer, and five of them are gonna be about scheduling a sample party. Because I need practice doing that and I wanna start wrapping people belly to belly. And then I'm gonna follow up with previous people that I've contacted on my 100s list. And so I've got them spread out throughout my calendar. I want to message current loyal customers, which wouldn't be very many. Um, based, it's going to be based on the date. So I'm going to follow up with them based on their auto ship date. And then I'm going to message distributors, current and new, just to make sure everybody's on task. What can I do for you? And then I'm going to figure out, message people with the credit card declines, whether it's a distributor or a cust uh, customer. So we'll try to figure out if we can maybe change their auto ship, change their date, change any of that stuff, and figure out you know, if we can get it cleared up for this month. All right, so I put all of that in this note section of this new um, planner that I have, which is super cool. And then I figure out how much time each of these things takes. And so if you'll see right there for personal development, I, have, I split it up into I'm going to begin the day with me and I'm going to end the day with me because I need to pour into myself. Um, happy wife is happy life. And when my family, when I am happy, my family is happy, believe me. All right, so I put some times there. So for person that developed in the morning, you know what, I'm going to take an hour for myself. I'm going to wake up early, um, and I'm going to, you know, do something for myself because it feels amazing to just be able to sit there and have a cup of tea and maybe do some little bit of yoga, maybe do some reading. I mean, it's pretty awesome. And then I'm going to end my night with some sort of walk or run, and I'm going to listen to some videos or, some, or to a call. Okay, and then I'm gonna grow my network. Growing my network, seriously, when it comes to It Works, my It Works business does not take very long. Growing my network might take me 10 minutes tops. Posts, it's gonna be random throughout the day, but I'm gonna throw in there that's probably gonna be maybe 15 minutes, and most of that time is actually um, <clears throat> me just looking through, trying to figure out what I wanna post. Okay, and then the last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna message, right? So I said, I figure about 20 minutes to message. So when you break this down, it's about 135 minutes that I need to find in my day, so about two hours and 15 minutes, and really, it breaks down to about an hour and a half being about me. And for It Works, it's only 45 minutes. So if you choose not to do anything for yourself or any kind of personal development, which I highly recommend you do, I'm asking you right now where I am in my position, I need 45 minutes to do my It Works business. Now, this is where you sit down, do a power hour, do power 45 minutes and do what I'm supposed to do. Now, if you're you know, messaging people during the day or, or responding to people during the day, then that's fine. I'm not including that. That's, I'm including these, these particular items that I have on this success list. All right, so my day, uh, my day will start and end with me when I take care of myself. Everything's in order, like I said, and all is well. So I'm choosing to wake up an hour early, earlier and to end my night with a nice walk or run, which is, I said. So there's my extra time. Okay, so I need 45 minutes to figure out where I'm going to put this. It works. And this, for this particular day on Thursday, my time is going to be split. Now, they recommend to try to sit down and just do it and then get it over with. But in this case, I, there's no way I can do that. So I've got to figure out where I'm going to put some time. So I'm going to grow my network while I'm cooking dinner. <laughs> so my kids are sitting down at the, at the table doing their homework. I'm cooking dinner, I can friend people on Facebook. I can like and comment on Facebook in the middle of cooking while they're doing homework so it's not taking away from family time. Okay, I'm talking 10 minutes. 
All right, and then I'm gonna, um, I actually in, in the morning, I'm going to figure out my posts actually at between, I think I can get to work by 8, 8.15, and so before I start my work day, I'm going to do my posts. And I'd like to use Buffer um, or some sort of app that will let you post in the future, and so the only ones that I'll be doing randomly will be my personal posts. And then um, messaging. So when I'm, um, I'm gonna message people during basketball practice, because usually my daughter will stay with uh, my mom, and in basketball practice, I'm just kind of sitting there watching. So I can go sit in the car and I can message people for 20 minutes. Awesome. I'm going to get all of that done at that time. All right. Well, on my regular normal day, because now that I'm part-time, I've got a break right here between one and two, and I'm going to do all 45 minutes during that power hour, power two hours. And what I may do is I may do some extra stuff. So it says today I have extra time and we'll do more or prepare posts for another day so I can free up some time for another day. If you guys use an app like Buffer, it's awesome because if you find things that you wanna post for each day, you can schedule it for each day and then um, it will notify you like, hey, it's time to post it and you just hit send. It's pretty neat. Um, so then I can also during this power hour, um, I know I'm going to get my 45 minutes done, but if I need to schedule some sort of interview with somebody, if I need to Zoom with a um, new customer or distributor, uh, potential distributor customer, I can do it during that time too, and then the rest of my day continues like normal. All right, and that's it. So here's the deal. It doesn't take very much to incorporate this business into your life. Figure out your schedule and figure out what your success list is. Figure out what works for you and then just get it done. And that's it. And ask. Just ask. Have you heard of this crazy it works thing? Are you interested in a product? Are you interested in making a little extra income? Just ask, okay? Because when, when you don't ask, basically when your mouth is closed, your business is closed, and we don't want that. So, all right. Let me know if I can help you if you need some help with this time management thing because I think I pretty much got it down. At least it's working for me. All right, we'll talk to you all soon. Bye.